Sup guys, Juggalo here. Hopefully I don't sound too out of it. Just check my blood sugar. It's 45. Drank some orange juice and ate something to spike it back up. So hopefully I make sense. If not, this is apologize or me apologizing in advance. I have downloaded a pretty cool program. It's called Display Fusion. It allows you to do two different wallpapers on two different monitor setups. So one for my triple screen setup and then one for the top and it's pretty awesome I'm going to show you how to do it I'm going to be recording via the camcorder because I don't want cam studio which records your desktop interfere with the settings or anything like that or cause any kind of complications which I have been noticing it happens in certain instances when I'm using certain programs so this is what the setup looks like now we have the Samsung 2343BWX monitor resolution 2048 by 1152 we have the triple screen monitors three Asus Swifts those are, are I think around 7600 something by 1440p so I definitely know that you're gonna go ahead and download the driver or whatever you want to call it, program Display Fusion, the latest one should be like 7.0. Download that, and once you download that, you're going to go ahead and go into your settings and ensure that it's on the free version, not the pro version, because it has a 30-day trial, and then I'm sure it's going to get you to try to buy the pro version after that 30-day trial. So I'm going to go ahead and show you oh, like a little brief overview <clears throat> on how to do that and adjust it to where it's the free version, not the pro version, and yada, yada, yada. So let me go ahead and move the camera towards one of these screens and try to implement it like so, so it'll be perfectly focused and I can see what I'm doing at the same time, but you'll be able to see what I'm doing too. So I already have Display Fusion installed and you're pretty much going to right click anywhere like you would get into your NVIDIA control panel and then click on right here display fusion you just go to settings and then hopefully it'll pop up on this screen and then what I have to do is show you where to do the basic um, deal so let me go ahead and read and locate and try to figure out where that is so just one second, sorry guys. So I believe, okay, you gotta click on license key right here. Let me go ahead and zoom in a little bit better. So you click on license key right here. So license key, and it's gonna say um, right here, if I zoom out. that if it has a pro version key loaded up you just have to change it to free like I have here click apply click OK and then you're pretty much good to go you don't have to worry about anything else alright so go ahead and close out of that so you can go ahead and right click again on your monitor whatever monitor doesn't have to be the top it could be bottom left right middle so go ahead and display fusion desktop wallpaper and this is going to give you the options and show you what I did <laughs> and everything like that what I did first is all you have to do is span an image across all monitors so it's going to take the scorpion picture and then expand it up top here or you can do use a different image for each monitor so I can click that where the top one has just a scorpion guy on there or I can drag and drop one second. This, click apply. It's going to take a hot minute. And then if you look at the bottom, it has Geek spanning across all three monitors. It's pretty cool. But what I like 
is scorpion. So what I do is basically you just load the top image right here, top monitor. And then once you hit span image across all three monitors, it's immediately going to take this, bring it down, and expand it to the appropriate ratio that you want. And you could do different settings and sizing and everything right here. So you can adjust it to best fit your monitor needs right here. So if you click on sizing, and then you have center stretch, tile, etc etc so yeah alright so now I'm going to go to up at the top span image across all three monitors click that and then as you can tell if I go up a little bit it's going to show you a little preview of what it, it's going to look like so you have that, you got the way you want it, looks good and everything like that. You can go ahead and then uh, click down on the menu where it says apply, right here. So it's going to take a little while to apply. Okay, it's done thinking. And then all I do is click OK just in case. It loads up again. And then from there, there you go. You have the Scorpion logo. Looks pretty cool. Thank you guys for your support. Really appreciate it. I do have a PayPal uh, donation if you feel that you like my videos and everything. Um, if you want to do that, that's fine. If not, I'm not too worried about it. But I guess that's it, guys. And as always, comment, subscribe, rate this video, click that like button, and you guys have a great day now.